it's it's vlogmas. <laughs> Yo, 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 we are, we at the neighbor's door right now. We're at the neighbor's door. Caroline. We're making, yeah, we're making our way to our door. No, for real. Like, we're literally, because, that, we're right there. We're there. You know we're what I'm saying? right there. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. Anyways, y'all, so, welcome back to our channel. If you are new, do not forget to subscribe. I am Tati and I am Brie and we are Tati and, and Brie, Brie, your favorite sisters. So we are doing 25 days of Christmas y'all and you don't want to miss the video so do not forget to turn your post notifications on and yeah we got um today we're doing get ready. We're getting ready. <laughs> we're getting ready. We're getting ready for the party. You hear me? The party's about to start in a few moments. And we're about to get dressed. And we're gonna chit chat with y'all. You know, just a little bit. Just a little something. Just a little something on the side. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Not too much, not too much. Not too much, not too much. We don't wanna give y'all too much. No, because you're my business. Oh. Don't do that. Don't do that. Whatever happens, what happens. Whatever. Girl, I don't know. Here it is. Okay. I'm going to go to the house. <laughs> anyway, Cher, um, let's get into this video. Let's get into the video. Let's get this. Let's get this. All right. Let's get this. I have a lip gloss. It's like on my on my tongue. Like so little one. Like, yes. Like, yes. Sun. Okay. So yeah, like Mac twenty sun. Did you probably face? No. Okay. So um. Today we are going to be doing a good right with me. We are using the primer from Hard Candy. This is the mattifying primer. It really does not work. No, it does not work at all. It just you, oils your face up. Like, I'm talking about like oil. I don't. My face is oily oil. enough. Why would I want more oil on it? And I really don't know why I put it on. I just put it on like I'm doing something. <laughs> You know, like y'all comment some mattifying primers. Comment yeah, like if you mattify. If you have oily skin, comment what primer you use. Um, because baby, it just be look like I put Vaseline in my face as soon as I do my makeup. No. So, honey, let's get this. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, child. Um, goodness. <laughs> When y'all do your makeup, what y'all start with? The eyebrows or the... Um, There's people that start, like, do their whole face and then do their eyelash, their eyebrows last, like... That's mm. weird. That's, that's, that's so that's weird. That's mad weird to me. Cause, like, you start at the top. I have to clean. And then you work my way down. Okay, so... What are y'all doing? <laughs> Stop playing! No. Stop playing! I'm trying to feel in my eyebrows. No, for real. Like, we just like, today we went like, we had a meeting with each other, and we just okay. like, oopsies, oopsies. And we're just talking about like the big things that we're gonna do for 2022, mm -hmm. baby. Like, did y'all start like, Putting out, mapping out, plan out for mm -hmm. next year. Yep. Because you want to make sure that you have a plan, mm -hmm. and you know, you want to make sure that you have a plan and you have a goal to accomplish certain things. I meant, yeah. You want to make sure that you have a plan mapped out. So we were just talking about the things that we want to accomplish. Um, all of our goals and opportunities that we have been set up for ourselves. 
So it's important, it's very imperative that you start out now deciding what you want to do for next semester. Literally next semester. Because literally there's only a few more days left in this month, baby. And we'll be on to the next. Also, um, <laughs> what you was gonna say? I don't know. I was just saying. Also, we was also talking about like our dating life too. Like, yeah, like literally, it's garbage. Like, mine is so trash that I don't even have one. My my dating life, it's not really a dating life because, you know. But my um, past, you know, experiences with the, the whole dating these last couple months, it's just like, everybody wants to play games. Like, they have game systems that they carry around with them. And they love to use them. On Mark. me. On me. I'm the remote controller. And my thing is, it's like, why play with somebody instead of just leaving the body where the alert? And like, so instead of just leaving that person alone, why not just, I mean, yeah, instead of just leaving that person alone, y'all rather just play around with people's time and Wasted. I never could get that. I never understood that. I no, never understood. I why people never do that. understood that. That's one thing I've never understood. It's like it's so, like so annoying because it's like they why take people you, go around, they and then they hard down act like they like you. No. Tell me for real. You do not. You do not like me. And I don't even want you to fake like you like me. But my thing is they, they fake it really good because they take you on these dates, they take you, it's the consistency and then out of nowhere it's just like gone. Oh, no, seriously. It's like, like literally gone in the wind, gone. Like I never even talked to you before. When it's like, first of all, you wasn't even that cute. I was trying to give you a chance. I was giving you, you a, chance. a chance. You're not even that cute. I was trying to give you a chance. And you you, you think you doing something by trying to act like you just played me. No, you played yourself. Yeah. Because now you finna see me like you ain't never seen me before. And see, I'm gonna start tagging you in my post. Yeah. Because see, before I wasn't... That's not mine. Don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> See, before I was just playing, I was just like, yeah, okay, I, I ain't gotta post today. I ain't gonna post today. Yeah. Oh, but now, now, baby, you just opened up yourself a can of worms. I am for sure posting like every day. Anywhere that I go, it's content for you to see. I'm not posting for anybody else. No. I don't care about anybody else seeing it, but mm -hmm. you. I, I take it that far. Because I'm gonna show you what you missed out on. I have to show you. Yep. And you're gonna be coming back because one thing about it is they always, always come, come back. back. They always I don't, come back. I don't care how long they haven't talked to you, they're gonna find a way to seep back into your life and it's gonna be too late. It's gonna be way too late, my love. And it always do be too late. Cause I'm gonna have me somebody else and I'm not gonna be able to talk to you, my love. I am so sorry, but not sorry. Cause remember, you didn't like me. You did not like me. Remember, you wanted to play the game. Yeah, so. You just, like with dating, like I realize it's literally like a game. Like, yeah, you have to be able to Get in, play the game for a little bit, and get, and out. get out. Coach don't keep you in too long. No, no. <laughs> Coach and if they not, don't, not if, if they don't want nothing, no, no. But if they feel like you're a good player, a good candidate, they'll keep. They'll do what they gotta do to keep you around. 
if you're not a good candidate for them, they're gonna try to play you so hard. They're gonna act like they want you in the game, but they don't. Yeah. They're gonna keep saying, we gonna wait till the um, have time. Have time. Then they say, oh, we'll wait till we wait closer to the end because I want to give them a surprise. Yeah. Yeah. I was a surprise. You surprised me. <laughs> you definitely surprised me at the end. Yeah. So it's just like you gotta get in and get out with these with these guys, especially here in this little And don't get attached. And you definitely can look. Let me tell you something. Shoot, I'm gonna say anyone because when I was back in home, it was nobody. But the, you gotta run back to your high, whole high school fellas. No, for real. And it's like I don't want you because you didn't even want me in high school. Right. So why would you want me now? Right. Yeah, Make they be like. Sense. They always be like, "Oh, I was so scared to come up to you." No, oh, it wasn't. No, you hush. wasn't. Stop lying. You're lying. It's a lie. Because what it's were a you, big lie? What were you scared of? What were you? Scared what of? balls? What were you scared of? You're lying. You're such a good liar. But, um, oh, yeah, like, my brother told me, that's what he told me, y'all, because I'm like, I was just trying to figure it out, figure it out, like, he said, you can't catch feelings for none of them, honestly, because they be so quick to, to tear you down. Mm-hmm. So quick. But, like, I, I really, I, I, um, I, I know the game. I know the game. You know, I'm starting to play the game. Oh yeah. And I don't even play like games. I'm I don't definitely to play, don't play games. I'm starting to play the game. So And I'm getting better at it than you. Yeah, it's it's a lot, child, but I don't even And then that's the thing, like we don't even date like that. Mm -hmm. Like like we don't like it's so hard to like talk to multiple people at one time. I don't know how people do it. I don't. I, I, I it's a lot of few. Me too. First of all, I don't know the numbers apart. I don't, I don't know. Don't save nobody. Number. I literally have to scroll up to the top. Me too. I page. gotta look through the messages. Yeah, and, like, and be like, oh, oh, who am I talking? First of all, I don't even know who I've been talking to. Me. I, I don't know your name because you're not saved in my phone. Right. So if we go out, I'm not gonna say your name. No. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry about that. <laughs> Unless, yeah, I, I just won't say your name. Yeah, I made sure I stay close so I don't have to say your name too. Right. So, no, yeah. for real. Yeah. yeah. So, and then it's like when you do give, when you do start dating, like, like okay, I'm gonna start dating. It just doesn't work. Mm -mm. It does not work. Like, I don't know what. I need the Lord to, to drop a new batch. Yeah, because this Cause the batch, batch that's on Earth is not good. It's kind of old. It's very old and played out. And that's the problem, I think. I think that's the problem. You think because this batch is expired? Because, you know, like when you have expired milk, you can't you use sick. it no more. Yeah. You got to throw it out. Yeah. So, I... I thought she was falling. <laughs> No, I totally, I can definitely 100% agree with you on that. Yeah, you get sick. So, I'm going to talk to him tonight. I've been talking Is to him he, about it. You have? Oh, yeah. And it's just like, he's just like, you know, you got to deal with it. Yeah, that's, that's literally what he told me. Because he said, if you don't go through these ones that are not good, you will never find the good, the one. good one. Because you stayed with the one that ain't good, you know? So if you feel like he ain't good, baby, drop him and move on. Because if you stay with him, you're gonna miss out on the one that's really for you. Yeah. Yeah. So I guess we just gotta keep going. And that's exactly what I've been doing. Just keeping it keeping it pushing. I, can't I have it. I just let him go and I just don't talk to nobody else. I mean, yeah, I do that, but like if somebody comes, bro, oh, yeah, 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 I don't, okay. I don't drop them and then start looking for somebody else no. right off the bat. No, um, I just drop them and I just like if somebody come around, I'm like, okay, well, we'll see how this goes. Yeah, you like, know, it, but it won't be nothing. Yeah, we'll just see how this goes. Yeah, makes sense because I feel like if you don't date, you're not gonna have anybody. Right. 
So and everybody needs need somebody. somebody. And we're sitting here talking about we need somebody. How you need somebody when you're not even trying to get nobody? You know what I'm saying? No, that's me. No, I. That's me. And and I'm also. It might be me. Yeah. I mean, I was like, I was at the point where like I would like cut off. I would never cut off, cut people off. Like, I mean, not I would never cut people off. I would um never give anybody a chance. Never give anybody a chance. I don't care what you bring to that table, baby. You could brought the whole table. You and, not, the, food, and the food and everything. Like, I just would not give people a chance. And like now, I'm like, this is why you're single. Yeah, like. This is exactly why. So like, I try to, now I'm a little, I try to be a little bit lenient and work with people because what you, what's on, whatever's on your list, you're not gonna get that list. Uh-uh, I don't care what, I don't care what, you're not gonna get that list. You're gonna have to reconstruct that list a little uh -huh. bit. Even Steve Harvey even said that. Like a lot of us come with this full list of this fairy tale person and it's not there. It's you have not, to yeah. You have to fix and reconstruct people, you know. And they're gonna do that. And the thing is, they will do that for the right person. So that's yeah. how you will know if that's the person for you. Yep. True because that. if they will some you know, alter things and True that, true that. Yeah. Don't look for a person for everything that you're looking for but look for a person that that's willing, willing to, to change for you exactly and you're willing to, you gotta be willing to change for them too because they got priorities too they got i mean they got standards too yeah you're not the only one with standards you're not so um i think that's important when it comes down to dating like if, no, if they're not willing to change some things up and alter things and let them go <sighs> baby let them go because, and even if like you keep telling them the same thing, thing. Over, over and over and over. Oh my goodness. Like you, no. Like, come on now. Like, no. <laughs> like, but see like, I had a person that was, like they were, they were changing things. Mm -hmm. But, they were just not fully there. You know what I'm saying? Like, like they would definitely change, yeah. Like they would definitely change some things, but they just wasn't there mentally as like a person. Okay. Yeah, so you gotta be mentally there. Cause then, yeah. cause then you can't give your full self because you're, you're not going through a hard yeah. time with your own self. Uh huh. You know, and I feel, I feel like that's a lot of things, a lot of thing, that's how a lot of guys are. Mm hmm Oh, yeah. A lot of guys are like that because guys get beat down through, through, through like heartbreaks and trauma and past situations. And especially black men. Especially black men. And they don't talk about the situation. They don't heal the situation. They just, you know, move on to the next thing or person or whatever yeah simply because they don't want to feel less of a man weak, yeah. they don't want to be weak you are the weakest link go bye yeah like they don't they don't want to feel less like less than a man but and then also some women don't want their men to exactly women beat down there's women especially in the black community they beat down men for expressing themselves and showing emotions and when it's like we're all human mm -hmm. We are all human. We mm -hmm. all need somebody. We all go through emotions. We all go through trials and tribulations. So mm -hmm. why beat somebody down just because he's a man? Like I would never ever do that to a person. Like because especially if you've experienced that type of you know situation within yourself. Yeah, you have a heart for anybody, woman, man, whatever. So that's how I feel about um, like when it comes down to that situation because that's a that's actually a like a really big thing why relationships don't work out. Mm -hmm. Because one of, one person is not fully there and the other person is fully there, but that person that's not fully there can't give their all because they're not there with themselves. 
So the you saying the one that's fully there mm -hmm. can't give their all. No, the one that's not fully there can't give their all yeah. because they're not there. They have like a lot going on and like mm -hmm. a lot of them fully fully there can't try to be the person for you and and themselves. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean people try to, but it's only so much that you can give a person. Mm -hmm. It's literally only so much you can do to help a person out to get them through their situation. Yeah. And they, that person has to want to be able to help themselves also. Yeah. I can't be sitting here trying to help you and you don't even want to help yourself. Right. Like, that can't play out right. Yeah, but if you know you need help, if you know you're not there, you need to go and get the help. Because at the end of the day, you're hurting nothing but yourself and the people around you. Mm-hmm. And then you you miss you lose out on really good people. You that's the biggest thing. You, you lose keep losing out. out on good people because you don't want to get yourself together. Yep. And then it hits you so hard. And then once you once it hits you so hard, you take that time to heal. And then you realize I lost an amazing person. And then it's too late. And to it's get that too late. Back. It's entirely too late to get that person back. And they're not gonna want to go back because they're gonna be like. Like, I tried to help you, like, I tried to be there for you, and you did not. You just pushed me away. You pushed me away. Yeah, that's why I say they always come back. Because whether it's they're dealing with themselves, or if they, if you're a good person, trust me, they're, the Lord is going to send them back. Mm -hmm. Because he's teaching them a lesson. He's teaching them a lesson. Yep, so... Don't hurt the ones that are there for you. No, for real. Moral of the story, <laughs> long story short. <laughs> so yeah, there we go. So yeah, long story short, treat those that care about you well. Cause you're gonna end up needing them and you're gonna end up wanting them back. And when you want them back, it's gonna be too late, late, my darling. Was there anybody that you ever like dealt with and you treated them bad and you wanted them bad? Um, like you know in your heart, like I did not do that person right. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. And I wouldn't say I wanted them back because even like okay we got back and then it was still like okay you're not the one yeah you know what i'm saying yeah i felt the same way too like in my heart i'm like oh i treated that person so wrong this could be the person mm -hmm. for me and oh yeah this could be the person for me and i'm just like lord send me back so he sent me back right mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and when i got back i'm like this is not it that was the yeah. same for me. Like I got back and I was just like, mm -mm. it was not. It was not it. But no, like I've definitely uh, had that experience. Like. And for me, like, you know how, like, people be like, oh, I wanted to be married by this age. I wanted to have this by this age. Mm -hmm. You know, like, when, it, especially when it comes with, like, guys and stuff like that. Yeah. What about you? Have you ever, like, knew, okay, I wanted to be married by this age. I wanted to be, like, have that certain age. I wanted to, like, settle down with Yeah, somebody. yeah. To have kids and. I mean, for me, I don't go by, like, by this age I want to have, well at first I actually was doing that, like by this age I want to have my person and be like settling down. Mm -hmm. But as life went on I'm just like, for one, nobody really wants that. Yeah. Like it's hard to find somebody that actually wants that. Mm -hmm. Like a lot of these guys are just out here playing girls and just playing around mm -hmm. because they're not fully there with themselves. And um, it's just hard to get around to the right person. Yeah. So like now I'm just like 
you know, testing the water, seeing what I don't. But yeah, so you're seeing guys um, don't want that. Yeah, it's just like a lot of guys don't want that. They don't want to settle down. At least I'm not coming across them. But I, I don't know. Like I, is there like a town? Where I was, that's what I was trying to say. Is it because you know a lot of people say like this where you'll find the good guys mm -hmm. at like they have that southern hospitality mm -hmm. and all that and everybody go like South Carolina or something. I think South Carolina will be a good place to because it's the country boy. Some of the country boys out there. I mean, I'm a, I'm a, I'm seeing how I'm working with the ones that I got. Okay. Okay. I'm seeing how that works. Yeah. 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 And if nothing. We'll pitch out to some other brand. Ah! I'm gonna go ahead to um, South okay, Carolina like this weekend. <laughs> <laughs> this is so not good. Like nothing's coming out. You're not gonna get anything out of this. Okay. But um, yeah, I'm just I'm um I'm seeing I'm seeing what I'm what I'm working with like. She, guys, I'm gonna tell you guys, she always gets the good ones. While <laughs> I'm over here where you can't, I can't even start nothing up. <laughs> like, it is so annoying. Like, I'm talking about nothing gets started. And I'm sick of it. Like, I really wanna go off on everybody that comes my way. Yeah. I don't, but like, I don't, like I get good ones, yes. I've came, I've got, I've really gotten some good ones. But it just never fully works out for me. Like I've had um, the ones that ghost me. I've had the ones that's just like narcissists. I've had the ones that literally lied about their whole life. <laughs> like, but the literally everyone that I've talked about talked to, I was the one that well. One of them, I don't know, he was, I thought he died, but <laughs> he was still alive. <laughs> he he, was, he was, yeah. Yeah, so he told me I'm still not that girl. I'm still not that girl. He told me I'm still not that girl. So he was still alive. I don't know what happened. To, I think he had a mental thing. Literally, every guy that I have talking to, they've come in like so good. And then they just like, they can't handle the situation, they can't handle life. Like they're always going through something. And I'm like, okay, I can help you out. No, I guess they don't be wanting me to help them out. They don't want, a lot of guys don't, like I said, they don't want a girl to see them down. So they literally just rather handle the situation on their own and come back when they're together. But there's no, you can't do yeah, that. Yeah, you, you can't do you that. You can't expect somebody to yeah. be there for you when you're, you leaving them in dark and silence, not saying anything, just telling me that you're going through stuff. But I'm yeah, going through stuff too. Yeah, but I'm, still, I'm, I'm still, still here. I'm still here, and I still want somebody. Like whoever you have, they can help you go through what you're going through. Mm -hmm. I'm still get my dog on a tennis chair. Yeah, like, I'm present, yo. Yeah, I'm present. But yeah, a lot of guys, they just don't, they don't know how to handle life. When stuff comes at them, so they literally just drop dead and drop everything and everybody who's there for them. I've realized that, and literally with my guys, it has been the same exact thing. They're all, they all end up going through something. All of them. And they always come back though. Literally everyone has came back. Every last one of them. So, it's not me, <coughs> it's them. And um, me, mm, <laughs> well, I don't, yeah, I, don't I don't know what it is, Honestly, it's annoying. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, that. yeah, that is annoying. Like I like my guys, they always, I always go on good dates. Like I always, mm -hmm. all of that, always. But I guess like when the red flag is there, you have to use it. Yeah. 
because you won't end up hurt at the end. Mm -hmm. Even though they're coming back. Mm -hmm. At some point they're coming back, but when they come back, I'm, I'm over there. I'm so over there. It's like, we could have just stayed together and worked this out. What? No, no. You want to do it on your own. And now that I'm gone. You want me back, back, back. <laughs> but yeah, girl. It's not happening, happening, happening. Come oh, here. Oh, Ladies, yeah. be safe out there. You hear me? It's a lot of no good ones. And it's a lot of there's a lot of players out there and it's a lot of want one things out there and it's a lot of mm -hmm. don't want nothing and it's a lot of I haven't I haven't fully met the one yet. I'm, I'm praying for it still. So hoping soon. I meet that one. Cause I don't like dating. That's my thing. I think and that's, that's my thing too. Like I hate the process. I hate it. I don't like it. Like I don't want to know what your favorite color is and stuff, stuff like that. No, like for me, like I just don't like the process of keep starting over. Yeah. Starting over. I don't like that. Saying. I don't like that. And I'm not, I'm not the type of person to date person to person. Like, yeah. Date, date, date. No, I'm not that type of person. I just want to be one person. Why is it so hard to find one person? I don't want to be out here dating multiple people. I don't want to be. No, I don't want to be doing that. Like, I just want one person that I can give myself to. That's it. It's not that hard. Mm -mm. Like, it's not that hard. It's not. I'm trying to tell you. But they make it so hard. And what we get on my nerves is they be talking about. Oh, I'm looking for a wife. I'm looking for, but it ain't nobody out there. Yes, it Shut is. Up. They're right in front of you. You just don't see it because you're not mentally and physically ready for it. That's what it is. They're definitely out there. You're just looking for that one person. No, you're not. No, you're, not. you're looking for multiple people because when you have that one person, you, you still want to be with other people. Exactly. So, so stop the lies. Stop the lies. Stop it, I say. You're done. You're done. You're done. You're all the way done. And so am I. <laughs> no, seriously. Right. But yeah, girl. I came across another one, so. <laughs> yes, <Yeah>, she did. <laughs> Somehow the Lord keep lining them up quickly, and I'm thankful for that. While I'm over here just like do 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 twiddling my fingers. <laughs> <laughs> but no, we're gonna see. So yeah y'all. That's really the end of this video. <laughs> like we just wanted to talk about like some dating stuff and like Y'all comment down below, y'all date, like give us some dating advice, like tell us what we need to do, what we don't need to do. Um, and I don't wanna hear that, all that, um, focus on your career and all oh, that. No, I was just gonna say I don't that. wanna hear that, cause listen, we all focusing, but we can multitask. I hate when people come in saying that. Oh, I'm just focusing on my career right now. Focus. No, you're not. No, you're not, no, you're not. Cause if somebody come right now in your DMs, or if somebody come up to you, you're gonna talk to them. I used to use that excuse. I was using that too. I used to use that all the time. Then I'm like, this is why I don't have anybody. Mm -hmm. Keep saying, coming up with these dog on dumb behind excuses. I'm waiting on the Lord. I'm wait. No, you're not. No, you're not. No, you're not. So, stop it, I say. Stop it. Like, we all should be out here dating right now. Cause mm -hmm. how do we expect to find the one? Or how do we expect to know what we like and what we don't like? If you're if not you dating date. a body. Right. If you don't date a body, you'll never know. <clears throat> you'll never know what body you need. And what body you like. You hear me? Yeah, so. 
I just been trying to get out in it, you know, tap my feet in a little bit, see what I can find. I need to um, tap mine some more because I'm not tapping. Mine. You're not tapping hard enough. Mm -hmm. You're not tapping hard enough. You gotta get at it next. Like I'm tapping a little bit, but it's because I've had some people. Hmm. Yeah, I'm tapping a little bit. It's because I've had some people, and I just like am getting over people. So yeah, you need to tap a little bit harder so you can get people, so that you can have people get over and stuff like that. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yes, I get what you're saying. So. Yeah, and you like you can't cut people off too quick. I'm working on it. Cause no, look, no, for real. Cause it'll be nothing. You'll have nobody. You'll have nobody, for real, for real. Like, and then you saying it's them, but it's not them, it's really you. Yeah. Yeah, I'm but it's only to a so much powder on and I'm still getting so oily. <laughs> the oil's coming out as you put the powder on. Yep. But no, like, it's up to a certain point. Yeah. Like, if it's something like, it, it, it honestly, it all depends on what it is. I've never experienced what you experienced. So I've never had, I never really had to, what, like, like just only texting and stuff like that. Yeah. I've never really experienced that. So I can't really say, you know, but like, that's something where you don't deal with. That's something where it's like, no, cut them off. Yeah. Cause, the, Cause I feel like you need to take people out on a date. Yeah, that's I mean, the only way you're gonna get to know people. When you can when you come at people, when you go, come yeah, at people, yeah. Like if I was going at somebody, okay, let me line some stuff up. Look, okay, let's go here. Right. You're still gonna pay, but let's just but go. let's just go. You know, I'm just suggesting it. No, but for real, y'all like. If somebody's down to just literally only text you. Only texting, y'all. Only texting. They don't want anything. I'm like, get out of here. They don't, they do not want anything. And I, and, well, actually, I, I have, um, dealt with that with one other person, but I don't even be, I don't even be talking to him because it's just like, you're not, you're not setting anything up. Right. If you're like, not setting anything up, get out, get out of here. No. Get out of here. For real. Cause I'm so used to like people setting stuff up immediately. Like in good stuff. In good stuff. Yes. I'm used to that. So now, no, you need to be setting as soon as I meet you, you need to be setting the date up. <coughs> and I don't want all that takes and stuff. I don't want it. Save that. Yeah. Save yeah. it for somebody else. Yeah. I don't want it either. So yeah, I, look, gone, okay? Yeah, like, you're wasting, like, you're wasting, you're wasting space, space on, on my phone. phone. For one, you're Well, your number's space. not saved, but you're wasting You're still wasting space, space because the more messages, messages that come in, yeah. right, the more that it's gonna take up space on yeah. my phone. Yeah, so every time I delete a message, you can't, you gotta stop coming back with, with another, another message, one. right? Because now you're just taking up so much space to the point, look, I don't need, I don't need you. I don't, you're not doing anything for me. You just take up space in my phone no. so you can keep moving. And you came at me. So you came at me. Yeah. Yeah. So like, if you're coming at me, you better have you better come a good hard. reason and you better come hard. Yeah. So I've never went to a guy, have you? No, I haven't. I but it may start having it to may, happen. Yeah, like for real, for real. I've never went to a guy. I mean, I replied to a guy's message. Um, I'd like DM him first, but it was something off his story. Yeah, which that's, I think that's like if he's liking your stuff and stuff like that. That's clear. That's like that's clear as day. Like yeah, yeah. Somebody wants something. Yeah. yeah. So somebody gotta do it first. And I guess I'll DM you something from your story and then go from you know, there. Yeah. Yeah. So. But yeah, ladies, you put it, oh yeah, that was good. Thank you. Mm -hmm. But yeah, ladies and gentlemen, um, 
Y'all, like I said, y'all be straight um, safe out in these streets, girl. Cause, Cause baby, girl, they out to play. They out to play. They, they this was really they, they time to play. Like from, I say from like September to December. Because that's like the holiday. That's the holiday. Time. They don't want you to tax. They, they don't want their family Thanksgiving dinner. No. Nope. And they don't want you to have to buy them a gift for Christmas. No. Nope. They don't want to have to buy. They you don't want to have to buy you no gift for Christmas, baby. So they out here playing these games. So be careful. Be real careful what you're yeah. doing. Yeah. So um. Anyways, y'all, we have finished our makeup and our hair. Mm -hmm. Um, we just added curls to it from you know earlier, mm -hmm. and you know the little something. something. But yeah, y'all. Anyways, um, thank y'all for tuning in. We just did a little chit chat with y'all. Yeah, yeah, we did. We did a little chit chat. So we will see them. No, that, no. If they like this video, you want to go ahead exactly. and like, comment, exactly. share. And subscribe. Follow us on all of our social media. They will be on the screen in the description. Down below. Down below. Down below. Oh, oh, oh. Now, we will see y'all in our next vlogmas.